Hello all, I'm Randy, your Lorcana librarian, and welcome back to The Sex. Uh, Lorcana launch week is upon us, and uh, there is a multitude of product out there. Uh, in a previous video, I went over the starter decks, I unboxed them, went through the cards that were in them, and opened the booster packs that were inside. Uh, so next, what I want to go through is the fancy Illumineers Trove. Um, this has a variety of things. Uh, mostly it has a bunch of booster packs, it has... Uh, some paper deck boxes, it has some uh, counters, and it's going to have, uh, from what I've seen, a player's guide, and the box itself is a handy storage option, um, at least for a while, uh, until you accumulate too many cards. Um, so let's go ahead and crack it open, and we'll just kind of go through the contents. All right, and here I have the Illumineers Trove. Okay, first and foremost, before getting into the video, you'll notice my fancy uh, Mickey Mouse uh, Steamboat Willie uh, playmat that I was able to get uh, that I showed in a previous uh, video with all the stuff that I got. Um, I was lucky to get this because I played with it at my local gaming store today at their starter deck challenge and a lot of people were interested in it because apparently this one has been very hard to get your hands on. Um, so just take a moment to appreciate. And that's about it. Okay. So here I have the Illumineers Trove. Um, it is a almost perfect cube. Um, you know, you have uh, Maleficent, Mickey Mouse, Brave Little Taylor, Elsa, which are the characters that uh, show up on the booster packs. Uh, on the side, you get Simba, Aladdin, and Aurora, uh, who appear on the starter decks, along with uh, Mickey Mouse, Wayward Sorcerer, Moana, and Gorilla Deville, who also appear on the starter decks. On the back, uh, you're treated to a uh, piece of art of each of the inks and also the contents. Uh, the listed contents are uh, a storage box, which is the box that all of this comes in, uh, two deck boxes, eight booster packs, and 15 uh, damage counters along with a player's guide uh, to the first chapter. Um, the box itself is not cellophane wrapped. Um, instead, uh, to cut down on plastic, what they have done is uh, basically created an outer sleeve and right here uh, we have a pull tab that I will go ahead and undo. Uh, okay. So everything kind of pretty much unfolds as normal. You got a nice little fancy box that is inside. We'll go ahead and get that out. Put that to the side. And so um, pretty much as the outside we have those three characters, and we also have the rest of the starter deck characters all around. Um, I'll go ahead and kind of turn this upside down carefully uh, to not jostle the contents too much. But on the underside, we have a image of the uh, Great Illuminary, uh, which is the setting for uh, the story of Lorcana uh, so far. Uh, let's go ahead and get this uh, box topper off. Um, uh, that's a little worrisome, uh, that one of the packs managed to get on top, uh, but uh, let me just slip that back in there. Um, so here we have the player's guide. Um, it does have some, uh, pieces of the story. Um, it has some, uh, deck building tips, uh, some combos you might not have thought about before. Um, and then... Towards the back, uh, we basically have every card uh, in the set. Uh, there is a checkbox to check the base uh, version, foil, and then there's a third blank space to write in if you get it as a promo, um, or as we've seen uh, since uh, the announcement of this uh, Illumineer Strove, um, the Enchanted Rares. Uh, so you can kind of go through all of that and it'll just have every card that is in the set. I'm going to set that aside. Uh, next, we have these uh, paper, well, cardboard uh, deck boxes. Um, essentially, they are just folds, uh, fold outs. Uh, so as long as you uh, are able to get them, fold it out, and they do come out very easily. Um, let's see, this is going to be trouble. Uh, I think that might pull down. Okay, there we go. Um, it's a nice little deck box to put your stuff in. So this one has uh, Mickey Mouse, Brave Little Taylor, um, and Moana on the back. 
and then I'm gonna set that aside. And then I won't assemble this one, but this one has Mickey Wayward Sorcerer, as well as uh, Aurora. We also have some uh, cardboard uh, damage counters. Um, these are similar to the ones that we get in the starter deck, um, although I believe, well, yeah, this is it. Um, but, you know, it's more damage counters if you got the starter deck. So I'll set that aside. Uh, let's see. So we get eight booster packs. Uh, yep, eight. We got them all there. And then a storage box. Uh, the width. So these come out uh, as little dividers. Uh, but you are able to essentially use this as a storage box. Uh, just kind of, you know, slot your cards there as you accumulate them in with any of us collectors, uh, at least from the ones I've seen also making videos and just on uh, various social media platforms, we're all gonna be accumulating a lot of bulk uh, just from, you know, most of us trying to hunt down those enchanted rares. Uh, and so uh, this storage option is gonna be greatly needed. Uh, so let me go ahead and set the box aside. And we will go ahead and crack these packs open. Okay, so let's go ahead and get a Maleficent here. I swear these are gonna give me trouble every single time. But. So we got one of Mickey's legs. Yeah, let's go ahead and put these over, uh, turn these over. So we have Mickey Mouse Steamboat Pilot, Magic Golden Flower, Scar, Timon Grub Rustler, Dr. Facilier, Hercules True Hero, Donald Duck Musketeer, Rapunzel, letting her hair down. Rafiki. Ooh, I got a Mickey Mouse Musketeer, so that means I have um, all three Musketeers now. Uh, that is our rare, rare, rare slot. I have an Ursula Shell Necklace. And I have a Foil Lilo Galactic Hero. Set those aside. I'm going to try and keep these in a somewhat uh, neat pile. Um, I've been in entering my booster pack information on lorcania.com. I'm pretty sure they are going to be happy for uh, all the data. These don't want to open easily. Why not? I mean, I guess that's great for security, but it is a hassle for the purposes of this video. Okay. Ooh, okay, let's see if we can go for the quartet. Okay. Megara, pulling the strings. Mickey Mouse Detective. Peter Pan, Fearless Fighter. Simba, Protective Cub. Jafar, Wicked Sorcerer. Captain Hook, Forceful Duelist. Dr. Facilier's Cards. Triton. The Sea King, You Have Forgotten Me, Steal from the Rich, Aladdin Hero Heroic Outlaw for the Super Rare, and then, oh, a Tinker Bear, Tinker Bell, sorry, Giant Fairy uh, Super Rare. Um, that is kind of exciting. Um, I know that this has kind of been a hot card. Um, I am kind of looking at a deck list uh, more and more that involves uh, her, so I am excited to have uh, that card. So let me go ahead and put this one aside. All right, there we go. That one ripped a little easier. Wow, okay, all right, all right, all right. This is starting to look uh, better and better on the Mickey. All right. 
All right, we have a genie, the ever impressive. Develop your brain. Scar, fire usurper. Healing glow. Dr. Facilier, charlatan. Kristoff, official ice master. Mad Hatter, gracious host. Chief Tui, respected leader. Prince Philip. Jafar, Keeper of Secrets. Tom Atoa for a super rare. And one jump ahead for the foil. Okay, we got all four that maybe bodes well. Uh, as always, I'm hoping to pull not really any of the enchanted rares, but more specifically the Stitch Carefree Surfer. So maybe that's a good omen there. All right, so I have Stampede. Work Together. Gaston. Akuna Matata. Magic Broom. Bucket Brigade. Beast Smear. Beast, hard-headed. Captain, Colonel's Lieutenant. Befuddle. Maurice, world-famous inventor. Dr. Facilier, remarkable gentleman. And a freeze foil, uh, which looks really good in person. Okay, it looks like we're halfway through the packs uh, that we got in the Illumineers Trove. Still hoping for a big hit. <laughs> well, that didn't go as planned. Okay. Oh, what do we got? And another leg. But we already completed the picture, so we're all good. Okay, so we have Stolen Scimitar. Aurora Briar Rose, Tangle, Stitch, Archimedes, Prince Eric Dashing and Brave. And what I'm starting to notice more and more is that when it comes to the uh, common slots, uh, we seem to be getting um, one of each color every, well, most of the time, if not every time. And so I guess that might be a good thing, just depending on the deck that you're trying to make. Uh, but let's go on to Flynn Rider, Charming Rogue, Eye of the Fates, Mickey Mouse, True Friend, Corella DeVille, Miserable as Usual, uh, as featured in the starter deck. Ooh, a legendary John Silver Alien Pirate and a common Hercules True Hero. Still hoping for some bigger hits, but anything we get is always good. Okay, I wonder if we'll make two sets in one go. That'll be amazing uh, for this Mickey concept art. So we have Horus, No Good Scoundrel, Jasmine Disguised, Elsa Ice Surfer, Control Your Temper, Maleficent Sorceress, Hercules True Hero, Smash, Dragonfire, uh, that's a good card, Sven, Official Ice Deliverer, Sword of Truth for the rare, Musketeer Tabard for another rare, and a rare Maleficent Uninvited for the foil. Almost at the end here with our packs. So hoping, hoping for an enchanted maybe in, in 
in this Illuminere Strove. Oh, oh, maybe we will get two full sets. Now, a lot riding on this part right here. But we have Sudden Chill. I, you know, I've never, honestly, I've never uh, remembered how to pronounce his name, so we're just going to call him Phil, uh, like most people do in the movie. Uh, he's got a sword. Control your temper. Friends on the other side. Simba, future king. Jasper, common crook. Aurora, regal princess. Goofy, musketeer. Stitch, abomination for the first rare. Uh, the queen, wicked in vain for the super rare. And a stolen scimitar for the foil. Okay, so we're on to our last pack here. And uh, as I've heard uh, people like Leonhart and Primetime Pokemon uh, say, hopefully we just have some last pack magic. Hopefully El Elsa uh, brings us some uh, good fortune. Are we going to do it? Are we going to do it? And we did it. That is, whew, that is amazing to see. Okay. Aladdin, Prince Ali. Merlin, self-appointed mentor. Minnie Mouse, always classy. Sebastian, court composer. Jetsam, Ursula, spy. Captain Hook, forceful duelist. Starkey, Hook's henchman. Fan the Flames, Anna, heir to Arendelle, a super rare Mickey Mouse Artful Rogue, another super rare, the Queen Wicked in Vain, and a Mufasa, King of the Pride Lands, foil common. Um, so no, no last pack magic, uh, but some good cards in those packs all the same. Um, so that was, I mean, it was cool to see, uh, cool to crack open those packs and I'll see what I'm able to do uh, with any of those cards. Um, we were able to make two full Mickeys with these eight packs, which I think is a feat in of itself. Um, and so that'll be, uh, that seems to be everything in the uh, Luminaire Strove. Uh, it's a nice little gift box. I think it's an even better gift set than the gift set itself. Uh, I did not pick up the gift set. Um, I know it has, like, you know, oversized cards and some packs and stuff. Uh, but in terms of, like, actually, you know, giving a gift, you have a storage box. You have eight booster packs. Uh, you have a player's guide so that the person who may not be familiar with the card game can see all the cards and stuff like that. So I think that this is a really good pickup. Uh, it's a really good uh, introduction uh, to the card game. Uh, so that was everything that was inside the Illumineers Trove. Uh, that was kind of exciting uh, to see. Um, but that's going to be all for this video today. Uh, so if you haven't yet, go ahead and follow me over on Twitter slash X uh, at Lorcana Sacks and like this video. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Um, I hope to see you next time back in the Sacks.